Hello everyone, welcome to the Bug Expert channel. In this video, we will talk about solutions for friends who encounter FIFA 23 game failed to launch error. It is not known exactly what caused this error. Because of this, we may encounter many problems. We will try to give you information on how to fix this error by mentioning a few suggestions. Remember, these suggestions are based on solving common errors. Before we show you solutions, we will briefly talk about the forum. You can forward various errors you encounter to the community on the forum portal we have opened. For this, if your problem continues or if you encounter a different problem, you can get a quick response by sharing it on the forum portal. We care about your questions and suggestions. Users running the Origin application as administrators are talking about fixing this error. First of all, we can run the Origin application as an administrator and check if the problem persists. Although it may seem simple for you, restarting the computer can prevent possible errors. To do this, you can restart your computer and check if the problem persists. Major problems with the EA anti-cheat service can cause us to encounter various problems like this. For this, let's reinstall the EA anti-cheat service by following the steps below. To find the EA anti-cheat folder, first access the C folder and open the program files folder. Access the EA and AC folders in the folder respectively. Then run the eantichcheat.installer.exe program. On the screen that opens, select the FIFA 23 game and click the uninstall all button. After the application is uninstalled, select the FIFA 23 option again, click the install button on the left and perform the installation process. After this process, you can check if the problem persists by running the game. Disable any antivirus program you are using or delete it completely from your computer. If you are using Windows Defender, disable it. For this, let's write virus and threat protection on the start search screen and open it. Click on the manage settings option on the screen that opens and scroll down the menu and click on the manage controlled folder access option. After this process, let's disable the controlled folder access option and come back. Let's turn off the real-time protection that comes up and go down again and click on the Add or Remove Exclusions option. Click on the Add an Exclusion option on the screen that opens, select the folder and save by opening the folder paths that I showed on the screen. After the save process is complete, you can run the game and check if the problem persists. We will verify the game file integrity and ensure that any missing or incorrect files are scanned and downloaded. To do this, Open the Origin application and select the game FIFA 23 by clicking on My Game Libraries menu. Then click the setting icon and click the repair button. After this process, do not shut down or restart your computer until the process is complete. After the verification process is complete, you can check if the issue persists. Completely close the Origin application running in the background with the help of a task manager. This will allow the Origin application which is not running properly in the background, to run properly. After you terminate Origin, run it as administrator and check if the problem persists. Failure to start Origin services can cause us to encounter such problems. For this, we can reach the solution of the problem by following the suggestions below. In the Start Search screen, type Services and open it. After this process, double-click and open the Origin Client and Origin Web Helper options on the screen, respectively. Change the startup type of the two services to automatic and if the service status shows as stopped, click Start below to start the service and click the Apply button to save it. After successfully completing the processes, run the Origin application as an administrator and check if the problem persists. It could be any third-party software that is blocking EA anti-cheat. These are respectively, it can trigger the EA anti-cheat program of Faceit anti-cheat, Riot Vanguard, easy anti-cheat software to run. For this, if any of what we said is installed on your device, you can delete it and check if the problem persists. For this, Type add or remove program in the start search screen and run it. Then search by typing the name of Riot Vanguard, 
Faceit or a different third-party anti-cheat software application in the search field. After this process, uninstall the application and restart your computer to check if the problem persists. If you do not want to delete any of the third-party software, you can close it with the help of a task manager and check if the problem persists. Various problems in the origin application can cause us to encounter such errors. For this, completely removing the origin application from our computer and reinstalling it may help us to fix the error. After this process, download the origin application again by accessing the origin download link and check if the problem persists by performing the installation process. We can eliminate the problem by typing some lines of code that we left in the article into the command prompt. For this, type cmd on the start search screen and run it as an administrator and paste the lines of code we left in the article in order and, after the process is successfully applied, Restart the computer and run the FIFA 23 game and check if the problem persists. Yes, in this video we have provided information on how to fix FIFA 23 game failed to launch error. If you are encountering various errors, you can reach the community with your questions by accessing the forum portal we have opened. By supporting us, we can expand our community. Thank you.